Hey guys, welcome back. So today what I present to you, of course, I wish it was in better condition. Um, it is a, another giveaway binder. Um, a lot thicker than the last one. So there's a lot more cards in this one. We will go ahead and go through it with what is um, in this one. So there is four slightly nicer, uh, I guess you'll call them penny sleeves still. So you got three matte ones of different color blue light blue and magenta to include a zamazenta um nicer sleeve um i didn't do these x's this is a used binder from a collection i bought um so you've got your energies and each page is four cards um so that's how many cards there are so i got some energies again uh, quite a few energies um coming up more energies Hi, uh -huh, this is where we start to break away. So energies, oh, and the X's aren't on the cards. That's what, whoever previously owned this binder put X's on the binder pages for some reason. To include one of them swanky, spanky, manky um, stickers. Um, some Pokemon, finally. Um, oh, stick to, well, the end, sort of. Um, added some Digimon, just threw them in there. Some more Pokemon, some fossils, original Japanese fossils. Everything definitely varies between kind of a moderately played to fresh pulls um, for what's in here. Um, there is a hollow rare in here from base set. Uh, it is not in fantastic condition. We've got some reverse hollows from, uh, I believe, Evolutions XY. All right, so this is the base set giveaway uh, in this. It is a Nine Tails Hollow. Um, however, as I said, very beta condition. However, it's a base set Nine Tail Hollows included in this binder giveaway. So we're not giving away each individual card. This is just the whole binder as the giveaway. Um, some more cards varying throughout the ages of the Pokemon generation. Oh, oh, yeah, the pages reverse on how they open, so it, it changed. Oh, I missed a page. I am so sorry. Okay, well, when we do our page count, we won't include that page. Uh, so we'll do a total Pokemon count here in a second, uh, if you aren't already counting. Um, some more energy, some more cards, got some trainers. Uh, this binder is not my favorite for cards. Uh, I, I don't think when they designed this binder, they did a very good job. Oh, it was funny while, while I was putting away what I was reading. And Pharaoh's Seed to me is hilarious because, you know, he's just a base set Pokemon. But his attack only requires one metal energy and it's flip a coin until you get tails. So you can just, and there's some Pokemon that have this. This is just one that I'm pointing out for the video. This attack does 20 damage for each head. If you are good at flipping a coin, which is a possible thing I used to do as a kid, you could literally one hit someone's Pokemon, like a VMAX if you wanted. Uh, technically one hit, you know, depending on how you want to count it. Because there's no limitation until you get tails. It's your only limitation. So you can flip that coin and get 20 heads and you just did 400 damage if or not their weaknesses to metal. So to me, hilarious um, that you could completely wreck someone with a base set card as long as you're good at flipping coins. Okay, so I really screwed up. I must have gotten really tired and missed these two here. That is my fault. Um, so I mean, it just continues with more Pokemon to where it is. Um, cards. Uh, and uh, it, it's the Pokemon and trainer cards and um, uh, sadly not a rare because that is not the original. Uh, so yeah, it, it varies. There's quite a few cards in here. Um, so we'll count the pages and then we'll minus six. So there is um, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. It's probably 28. I probably double counted one of them. But so 27 times 4 is uh, 
108 minus 6, 102, and then add the, so there's 102 items in here, and then plus the four sleeves that are on the first thing. So there's 106 items in here, and I went ahead and gave it the Flaming Chicken Sinister on the back. So 106 items to include uh, a base set Hollow Nine Tails. Super heavily played, pretty much straight damage, just making that clear. But there is a base set Hollow Nine Tails in here with cards throughout the ages. Um, so this is a giveaway. Uh, I am up for debate on how I'm going to do this. Um, I am thinking, and uh, it's gonna probably be, um, let's just say, I said there was 108, 106 items in there. I know it's a lot, and the whole point is so you guys can't really count, so it makes it kind of random, and it kind of makes y'all have to play. Uh, I think we're going to go with the Comet competition. Um, 106 items, roughly 100 plus items, if we're not including Binder. Uh, let's say 550th Comet. 550th Comet. Not threaded, just 550th Comet um, wins this. Now you might be thinking, how am I going to count that? There is a way, I have a way, don't worry about that part. Don't worry about you being able to count, just comment. I have over 150 subs currently as I'm making this video. If each of you comment four times, that's over 550 comments. Um, and it can be anything. It can be a period, it can be a question mark, it can be a sentence, it can be a book, it can be a GIF, it can be a YouTube link. 550th comment wins the binder on this video. Um, and this video will stay up until that's completed. I mean, the video will stay up, period, but this competition will go on until that's completed, unless it doesn't go well for some reason and I have to do it a different giveaway style. But 550th comment wins this whole binder, everything in it. Um, and, uh, you know, snipe comments are allowed. So, you know, you could be the person who comments 549 times all by themselves, and then little Timmy does one little period after that and he's the 550th comment he's the winner so snipe comments are allowed so obviously it's 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 there's a lot of risk involved with how you comment and how you want to play and win um making it 550 comments does seem challenging i know it makes people probably not want to comment 549 times but i think it'll make people kind of come back with the video over and over again a little bit as long as everyone comments to look at the comment count and to add to the comments to increase the comment count um, so 550th comment wins this binder. I think that's fair. It's pretty much like five comments per item. Um, and uh, best of luck to everybody. Again, also, even though I did a giant blanket disclaimer at like the beginning of this channel series, I'll say it again. We do not ship outside of the continental United States. If you do happen to win, because you played anyways, which is perfectly fine, and you aren't in the continental United States, we can still ship it to whoever you request us to ship it to. You can have a ship it to a buddy you have in the continental United States, or you can have a ship it to just one random address for the heck of it in the continental United States, and we'll send it. Um, you know, obviously, you know, try and make, verify that it's a legit address. We don't want to send it and then have it return, and then we'll just do the giveaway again. But we'd really like the giveaway to get to somebody. So even if it's someone who's not inspecting it, um, that'd be really funny, too, to see how they react in terms of uh, getting something that isn't, you know, wasn't supposed to be theirs. But um, very interesting. Um, 550th comment wins. Good luck.